First, take a look at this man. He's wanted by police in Marenzi, Michigan tonight after they say he gave them the slip. Now he is facing a slew of charges. Welcome into 13 ABC Action News at 5. I'm Lee Conklin. And I'm Diane Larson. Thanks for being with us today. Police are asking that that suspect come forward after he somehow managed to get free from the backseat of a squad car while in handcuffs. This happened in the 300 block of East North Street in Morency, Michigan. The man was last seen there running down the block in the in a dark Sunday night. 13 ABC's Tony Geftis has this crime and safety alert. Craig Canfield is wanted by Morency police after they say he committed a crime, then pulled off an escape. Yeah, he left the scene with uh, blue athletic shorts on and obviously uh, handcuffs attached to the best of our knowledge. It happened on the 300 block of East North Street. Morency Police Chief Larry Weeks says Sunday night an officer went to a home here around 1130. Inside, he explains Canfield, who's 39, was holding a baby boy and refusing to hand him over to the infant's mother, Canfield's girlfriend. That's when the officer stepped in. Uh, led to a physical confrontation between the officer and the suspect and uh, fortunately the baby was safely returned uh, to the mother. The officer tells the chief he cuffed Canfield behind his back and locked him in the back seat of this squad car. The officer then went back into the home to finish collecting information. That's when the chief says Canfield, who's 5'6", 180 pounds, disappeared. Yes, he returned to the vehicle to finish up his paperwork and leave the scene and unfortunately the suspect uh, was not in the car and had left. The chief says the best he can figure is that Canfield somehow managed to get from the back seat to the front while he was in handcuffs by squeezing his way through this partition. The chief plans to review the department's procedures and determine whether officers need to make changes moving forward. Meantime, he's trying to find Canfield, who allegedly slipped out and off the radar. In Marincy, Michigan, Tony Geptis, 13 ABC Action News. And Canfield facing a laundry list of charges when police, and if they do catch him, kidnapping, resisting arrest, assault, and escape.